Now to some potentially bad news. Gas could start getting even more expensive again. OPEC announced today it's the biggest cut since the start of the pandemic. How does this decision affect you, the local consumer? Channel 8's Veronica Barreto talked to the experts. What are they saying tonight, Veronica? Megan and Rod, it's news we don't want to hear. In the past days, we saw gas prices starting to rise and they are expected to be higher. But experts say it shouldn't be as high as what we saw during the summer. OPEC is planning to slash oil production by 2 million barrels per day starting in November. It's the biggest cut since the start of the pandemic. Economy experts like Creighton's Ernie Goss says gasoline prices might go up, but the impact will be limited. I, ex I expect gasoline prices to, again, rise some more in the weeks and months ahead, but not anywhere close to the $5 and above uh, price that we saw earlier in the year. But the group of major oil producers, which includes Saudi Arabia and Russia, met early Wednesday for the first time in person since March 2020. They say the move comes of the uncertainty that surrounds the global economy and oil market outlook. Everything has a price. Energy security has a price as well. Goss says rising oil prices could mean inflation stays higher for longer. Meaning it will push inflationary pressures up more than what we would see uh, absent this action. This can add pressure on the Federal Reserve to hike interest rates even more aggressively. Gas prices hit its highest record in the United States back in June when the national average reached $5 per gallon. Even though Goss says it is not expected to be as high, Nebraskans will still see an impact on their pockets ahead of holiday season. So, uh, but the problem for Nebraskans and people in this part of the country is we drive for longer distances. So we use typically use a lot more oils. He says this can have an impact on how consumers will be spending money during the holidays. If people spend more on gas, they will have less to spend on the holiday season. And Goss also said that we have to keep an eye on how conflicts between Ukraine and Russia and conflicts between China and Taiwan develops. He says these events can have an even higher impact on oil prices. Yeah, we'll have to see what happens. Veronica, thank you for that report. And